is fun to watch. The stat in particular that everyone seems to be bringing up is the 82.1% completion. That's through four games, ladies and gentlemen. It's the number one all time through four games. It might be a LeBron stat, but that is a damn good LeBron stat. That is a fucking... There's one you can hang your hat on. That's the one right there. And it, it's what's been unique is the first game for sure, it was all dinking and dunking, and the ball was out quick. And he's still getting that ball out quick. He's got a quick trigger, yeah. But now you're seeing, and part of it might be defenses have seen that, and they're, it's forced them to defend. Reacting to it, yeah. You're seeing him take the shots down the field. You're seeing him make the big throws uh to McClure and, and to, down, it, yeah I was gonna say uh, and to his receivers credit they're making these fucking plays man yeah. they are Dude, making big time plays Zach who? Ertz Zach Ertz baby Zach Ertz out there making fucking plays baby I was just talking to my boy they listen they are having fun right now these last two weeks have been a coming out party for this offense Cliff Kingsbury has them rolling Jaden Daniels man I don't know if he's gonna be the next CJ Stroud the next Pat Mahomes, but there's something I like about it. There's something I like about watching it. Like it, there's a poise. There's a, there's a personality, Personality, there's an excitement. Like he's confident. I, man, I love watching him play. You use one of my favorite words on Monday Night Countdown. His moxie. Yeah. Fucking moxie. He's just got it. What does Andy call it? I don't know. Doesn't he call it like vibrato or what is it? Uh, uh, oh my gosh. Bravado. He he says it instead of swagger. He uses another term, and it's like an old school term. Or he did in Philly. I have no idea. I've never heard him say any of those words. Either way, though, man, the guy he's got the moxie, man, and he uh, he's got the bull by the horns over there. Cliff Kingsbury dialing the shit up against his former team. Me? Yeah, you could tell they were they were taking yeah. some good he got shots. The game man, ball. I'm happy as hell for my my two guys, man. I miss the hell out of these two guys, Nikki Allegretti and Andrew Wiley, two of my favorite teammates of all time. And you heard Andrew say he's having one of the most fun years of his life playing for that team. And sometimes the 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 excitement, and that's not to take away from anything that we did here in KC, the excitement of everybody not necessarily counting you in, maybe not counting you out, but not counting you in and to be able to day, week in, week out, you know, I don't know, answer that test and, and, and do it in a way that they're doing it. Man, it looks like they're having fucking fun over there in Washington right now, hitting on all cylinders, man. And uh, I just could, I couldn't be happier for those two guys. For sure. And on top of that, Cliff Kingsbury, who I, uh, who I know through old Patty Mahomes, man. Yeah, Jaden Daniels is taking the NFL by storm right now, and hopefully we get to keep watching that because it's exciting to watch, especially when a young guy and a team are dominating like that. Oh, yeah. 